I am going crazy trying teach while students are texting away on their cell phones. We should never have lifted the ban on mobile devices. Maybe we need to start using the devices kids bring to school every day in the classroom. I have been reading about mobile learning. What is mobile learning? Mobile learning is using handheld or portable technology devices, together with wireless and cell phone networks, to facilitate, support, enhance teaching and learning. It extends learning for both teachers and students beyond the classroom walls. We teach in different areas. What would this look like in my math class? Students learn at different rates. You must have some who take longer to learn a concept than others. You could create a simple screencast demonstrating how to solve a math problem and upload it to YouTube. Students can access it from their device anywhere anytime. They can watch as many times as they need to. That would help students who are having problems. But what about my really advanced students? The possibilities are endless. They can use their iPods to record themselves collaborating on a math problem they have to solve. They can share the video with you and you can easily assess their learning. I have always struggled to meet the needs of all my students as they learn in different ways and at different rates. Mobile learning sounds like it could help. With mobile learning students are able to control how and when they receive information. They are in control of their learning and they like learning with technology. They are the plugged in generation. With all this technology, I may soon be out of a job. They are carrying the world's knowledge in their back pockets. Just because kids have access to limitless information it doesn't mean they know how to use it. They still need to know how to use these tools and access relevant and reliable information. Ask a student to show you the apps she has on her device and they will be games and social networking tools. I should check out some useful apps for math. I hear you can buy a mobile device or netbook for the same price as a Griffin calculator. Yes, and the money schools and districts will save on textbooks and computer labs can easily outfit our school with a one-to-one -one pilot program for mobile learning. My science class is working on an inquiry-based project and they are using their cell phones to tweet with a class in halfway across the world. They are comparing water usage in their cities and ways to conserve this resource. Do you think there are other math teachers using mobile learning that I could contact? Of course. Let me show you how to start your own personal learning network. You can even do it all on your own smartphone. It would be great for your students to see you using your phone as a learning device. It would up your cool factor too. Where can I find out more about mobile learning? I have just looking at a wiki about mobile learning. It was created by three teacher librarians and is geared for teachers to use as a workshop to learn more. No matter where you are in terms of implementing mobile learning, there is something to move you along in your practice. You can even view it on your smartphone.